Hi guys, in this video, we will give you brief introduction on real-time one-to-one -one chat application using Ratchet WebSocket library with PHP script and MySQL database. We have already made chat application using Ratchet library with PHP script, but in that chat application, when one user has send message, then all other connected user can receive that chat message. So there are many viewer has requested us to publish video tutorial on how one user can make private chat with other user and that chat message cannot be viewed by other user. That means one to one chat, one user send message and only single user can view that message. So for this here, we have again come with one to one chat application tutorial with Ratchet WebSocket library and we will build real-time one-to-one -one chat application using Ratchet PHP WebSockets library. Under this video, we will give your brief introduction of this Ratchet WebSocket one-to-one -one chat application, so here you can view complete functionality of real-time one-to-one -one chat system using Ratchet WebSocket with PHP script and MySQL database. In this tutorial also, we will store chat message under MySQL database, and we will also learn how can we'll use Ratchet library for send one-to-one -one chat message, how to display unread message notification, and display user online and offline status also. This all feature, we will learn in upcoming 7 to 8 video tutorial. Now let's start, so this is login page of one-to-one -one chat application, so here we can see login page. So here we have enter login details. Here we have used same login page, which we have make in chat application tutorial series. So now we have click on login button. And after click on login button, here page has been redirect to chatroom.php. Under this chat room page, if user has send message, then that message has been received to all connected user. But now we want to send private message to particular user. So here on this chat room card title, we can see private chat button. So here we have click on this button. After click on this page, here page has been redirect to private chat.php and here we can see complete different user interface. Under this page also, login user can view his or her profile image. Edit button for edit profile details, logout button for logout from this chat system, and user list. Now we want to chat with any user. So suppose we want to chat with John Smith. So for chat with John Smith, we have simply click on this John Smith user. After click on user name, here right side blank area, we can see chat message area has been up here, and under this area, we can see chat message history, which we have sent and received to John Smith. And for send chat message, here below of this page, we can see text area field. So under this field, we can type chat message, and by click on this submit button, message will be sent to John Smith. Now let's try it. So here we have typed something in text area field, and click on submit button. After click on submit button, here message has been sent to John Smith, and in chat history, we can see last send message, which we have sent to John Smith. Now in another browser, we have already login in John Smith account, and here we have on private chat page, and here at Donna Hubba username, we can see one unread message notification. Same way. We have also login as Peter Perker account also, and here we can see not any message has been received. So here we have send message to John Smith, and he only received message, and Peter Perker is not received any message, so this way we can send one to one chat message using Ratchet library. Now here on screen, we can see all three user has come on private chat page. Now we have go to John Smith account, 
and here we have select donor hubba. After select donor hubba username, here we can see unread notification has been removed, that means user has read chat message. Now we have type something in chat box, and click on submit button, so here chat message has been sent to Donna Hubba, and she has received it, and Peter Perker has not received. Now we have go to again John Smith account, and click on Peter Perker user, so now John Smith can send message to Peter Perker, now we have type something in chat box. And then after, we have click on submit button, and after click on submit button, here message has been sent to Peter Perker, and at Peter Perker account, we can see one unread message notification has been appear in real time. This notification we have displayed by using Ratchet WebSocket library. Now we want to display user online and offline status in real time by using Ratchet WebSocket library. So for this, here we can see in all three account all user is online. Now, we have go to John Smith account, and then after we have click on edit button, so John Smith has leave private chat page, and in all other user we can see that, red color circle has been display, in place of green color, here red circle means, John Smith user is offline. Now in John Smith account, we have again go to private chat page, and after loading private chat page, here in both user account, we can see that John Smith status has been display online, with green color circle, so this way, we can display real time user online offline status, by using Ratchet PHP WebSocket library. So friends, under this tutorial series, we will learn how to send real-time one-to-one -one chat message, how to display unread chat message notification, and how display user online and offline status, by using Ratchet WebSocket library, with PHP script and MySQL database. This all things, we will learn under upcoming 7 to 8 video tutorial, so here we have stopped this video, and if you have some other feature in your mind, you can write in comment box, we will add under this tutorial series, and lastly in next part, we will display user data under this private chat page. Thank you for watching this video, we will be meet in next part of this real time one to one, chat application using Ratchet PHP WebSocket library with MySQL database.